x square plus y square is equal to 169. Comparing this to the equation of a circle, x minus h the whole square plus y minus k the whole square is equal to r square. The center of the circle that is h comma k is 0 comma 0 and the radius of the circle is 13 where x comma y is a point on the circumference of a circle. Now to check if the following points lie on the circle, these points should satisfy this equation x square plus y square is equal to 169. Now in option A, when x is 10, y is 3. Substituting this in x square plus y square is equal to 169, we'll get 100 plus 9 which is equal to 109 and that is not equal to 169 and because it does not satisfy this equation this cannot lie on the circle. In option B it says that when x is negative 3 y is 10. Again plugging in these will give us 9 plus 100 which is 109 which is not equal to 169. So this point can also not lie on the circle. Option C will give us 25 plus 144, which is equal to 169. And now this point ha also has to satisfy the equation y is equal to x minus 7. Because they're telling us that this same point lies on this line also. Now when we plug in x as negative 5, y should be negative 12. So, negative 5 minus 7 is negative 12, which is equal to y, which is negative 12. Therefore, this point lies on the circle and satisfies the equation. Now, to check option D, when x is negative 12, y is 5, will satisfy the equation of the circle, which will be 145, 144 plus 25, which is 169. Now when x is negative 12, y should be 5, we need to plug that in and y is equal to x minus 7, which will give us negative 12 minus 7, which is equal to negative 19, and that is not equal to 5, which means it does not satisfy the equation y is equal to x minus 7. So the correct answer is option C.